Hey guys, what's going on? Pete here. There's a cop driving by right now as we speak. Um, <laughs> regardless, we're good. Welcome to yet another video, guys. In this video, I'm going to talk about the cheapest mod that you can do to your car that doesn't void your warranty and gets the best performance out of a mod that's under $50. It's been in the car for about uh, one year now, and... Uh, I got it when I was two and I never reviewed it because I was uh, I was impressed by it and I kind of was uh, enjoying the benefits of it but I really didn't know what I was going to talk about. Now I've seen a couple other reviews of uh, other products and I, I know they all vary so um, for me I have the Torque Solutions Dog Bone Mount Insert and uh, that of course replaces the, the stock Dog Bone Mount. Um, so what I like about it. Well, uh, I'm going to say it does definitely change the daily drivability of the car, but not drastically. Um, when I'm driving, I do have a little bit of vibration in the, uh, the steering wheel, kind of when I'm putting a lot of load on the, uh, the clutch. Or um, when I shift, I can feel the DSG shifts, which is kind of cool. When I start up, the, uh, the car judders. I mean, essentially, whenever there's uh, a lot of uh, pressure on or I guess a lot of load being put on the engine or the transmission, you feel it through the steering wheel. However, it's nothing crazy. It doesn't vibrate really bad at all. Um, it's totally daily drivable. There are more aggressive ones, um, but I just went with the Torque Solutions, which is kind of, uh, as I, I've been told, a grand touring type of one. Like, it's, it's the middle range. It's, it's to get that performance that you want without compromising your daily drivability, because everyone wants that, especially when it's your GTI, because GTI is your daily driver. Honestly, I have no wheel hop. It really, really eliminates the wheel hop that I was getting from the, uh, the obviously the stock dog bone. Um, it was, you know, before I would keep traction on or even turn traction off, and if if the uh, the tires got a little bit dancy and I was given a little bit of gas, um, it would judder and it'd be so uncomfortable. It'd be one of the worst feelings ever. Um, and you know, you you just rattle your brain. It, it's it's a very uncomfortable feeling, and a lot of front wheel drive cars have it. Now with this insert, surprisingly, it's eliminated. It, it doesn't happen anymore. Of course it spins its tires, but I mean, it can do a really composed burnout now, where before it kind of just danced a little. And uh, now it's just super planted and I really, really like it. Um, another thing that I noticed too is my DSG shifts, is, uh, is maybe it's just me. Um, I see that some other people also feel the same. It's totally, it's, it's probably nothing that, it's probably not actually making a, a true impact, but the DSG shifts feel a little bit more responsive to me, and it's probably just me and the way I feel it, but um, I mean, I really like how I can kind of uh, get the feedback from my DSG. Uh, you know, when I'm driving and I'm fifth gear going up a hill, and you know, the steering wheel starts to vibrate a little bit, then that's when I know, okay, I should probably downshift because I'm putting a lot of load on the clutch. So, uh, I mean, all in all, I really, really like it. Uh, it. It makes driving this thing just so much more enjoyable, so much more engaging. And of course, you want something more engaging when you have, you know, a car like this. And uh, of course, when you have DSG, you're kind of robbed of that true engagement. Uh, and I'm not going to bash on DSG. I love DSG. I, if I were to buy another GTI, it'd be DSG. Uh, and I'll make a video on that talking about uh, why I went with DSG over manual. But. Uh, yeah, for the most part, I mean, I, I really, really like it. It adds a whole new element to this car, and just for $45, I think that's what mine was, and I might have got mine on sale. It uh, doesn't mean you guys can't, so uh, it's a really great mod. I'm pretty sure it doesn't void any warranty, aside from, you know, maybe you want to go back to the stock one. They're not just going to, like... I mean, they may. I don't know. It depends on your dealership, but for the most part, uh, this does not void any warranties, and it's really, really cheap. Depending on which one you get, I got Torque Solutions. I have nothing but good things to say about that one, but I'm sure there are uh, th there are other, maybe better ones out there that you guys can try. But for the most part, I really like my Torque Solutions uh, mount insert. It's, it's just awesome. Um, now, uh, I'll switch the video to a little bit of a POV so you guys can kind of see this car driving along. And uh, yeah, so I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. Yeah, you can feel the shifts through the steering wheel. It's, it's just, it's really, really nice. It's a satisfying feeling. All right, we'll put the car into sport mode. We'll maybe close this a little bit. We'll get just pure in-cabin sound. Nothing from the outside. All right, I don't know why my pops are not working, but they're not working. Actually, that might be an indication that they're tired. <laughs> Who knows? All right. Uh oh. There you 
You guys ready? So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next video. I have a lot of cool ideas in the works and I can't wait to share them with you guys. So catch you guys in the next video.